Good day everyone and welcome to today's tutorial. Before us here is a question on exponential equation and it says square root of 2 raised to power x minus 3 bracket open bracket close raised to power 4 equal to 16 and you are asked to find the value of 4 raised to power x. This is a very simple question. We can approach it in different ways. So, start by saying solution. So, now remember this here is having the inside and the radical side, which is this uh, root equal to this right hand side, which is what equal to 16. So, the first step we are going to look at now is a first of all look for a way to remove this root. We need to remove this root. Then how do we remove that? Recall in indices that x x raised to the power half is equal to what square root of what x. So in indices, when a number raised to the power half is equal to what square root of that number. So in this case, the whole of this inside here, this bracket here, is likened to be our x. So therefore, we are going to remove this root now. So uh, the whole of this thing now will be raised to what half. So at this point, we are going to have uh, 2 raised to the power x minus 3, then raised to the power 4. Then remember, this half here is going to multiply times half equal to 16. So what does that mean? So it means that what? our 2 raised to the power x now minus 3 bracket. So here, in this place, these two will cancel this 4. Here it becomes 4 over 2 equal to 16. Now, this 4 here will be cancelled by 2 here. So that we now have a 2 raised to the power x minus 3 raised to the power 2 equal to 16. So the next thing we are going to do now is to do away with this now. So how do we do? You find the square root of this 16 here. So at this point now, we are going to have a 2 raised to the power x minus 3 then you remove these two they now give us equal to square root of 16 and square root of 16 is equal to 4 so therefore we have 2 raised to the power x minus 3 equal to 4 the next thing we have to do now is to move this one to the other side of the equation so we are going to move this to the other side of the equation. Now, we say 2 raised to the power s equal to 4. This minus 3, move it to cross to the other side. It will become plus 3. Which will now give us, implies that 2 raised to the power s equal to 7. But remember, the question says we should find 4 raised to the power x. So we don't need to use any exponent or logarithm. We don't need to apply a lot of logarithm here. You can just put 4 raised to the power s. You see the setting as inside this 4 here. 4 here is setting as 2 raised to the power 2. So that we now have 2 raised to the power 2 here. Then we have another power here, which is this uh, x raised to the power x. So this is 4. Okay. And the 4 here is written as what? 2 raised to the power what? 2. Then we now have uh, x which is here. Then the next thing now, uh, we now apply that. It's written as what? Since according to the law of indices, when power is here, another one is here, what will happen is that it will be multiplied. We now have uh, 2 
raised to the power 2x. And in indices, this can also be written as 2 raised to the power x, since we can interchange the power as equal to 2. So we can interchange the power 2 raised to the power x, then raised to the power 2, because at the end of the day, these two we also multiply this one and we also multiply this one to become what? 4. So in that case now, and remember we said that our, our 2 raised to the power x, 2 raised to the power x here is equal to 7. So therefore, 2 raised to the power x, just plug in 7 inside here, just put 7. It becomes square. So when you plug in 7 there, at the end of the day, your 4 raised to the power x is equal to 49. So your 4 raised to the power x is equal to 49. That means inside our 4 raised to the power x, we are having 2 raised to the power x twice. That is the answer to the question. If you find this class very interesting, please do not hesitate to share this video and also subscribe to our YouTube channel. God bless you.